Hi guys, this is Subhashish Mishra, your test coach. In this playlist, I will help you to learn different Java programs which are frequently asked in software testing interviews. Please like, comment and subscribe my channel to get more updates about the new learning tutorials and keep motivating me to make more such kind of videos. Today, we will start from a very basic program that is swap two numbers using a third variable then swap two numbers without using a third variable. If you don't understand and if you have any questions, please ask it in the comment section. I will try to explain that. So let's go to the Eclipse and create a class. So here, let me create a new class and name it as swap two numbers. Then let's take two integers int n1 int n1 equal to 20 then int n2 equal to 30. We are taking two integers. These two integers we will swap. So what we are expecting? So our program should result as n1 equal to 30 and n2 equal to 20. So we will use a third variable. So, we will take another variable int temp. Let us print these numbers before swapping. So, we will write something like this before swap plus n1 and we will write plus n2. Let us print it. Let us execute and see what is. So, before swap value is 20 and 30. Now, let us swap it. Temp equal to we will write n1 then n1 equal to n2 then n2 equal to temp. Do not worry, I will explain all these things. What we have done right now, we will just write after swap. Let us execute it. So, before swap value was 20 and 30 and after swap 30 and 20. So, what we did? We are telling temp equal to n1. What it means? We are assigning n1 value to the temp. So, what is the n1 value now? n1 value is 20. So, what happened? Temp becomes temp became temp value became 20. Then what we did? n1 equal to n2. It means we assigned n2 value to n1. So, what n1 be value became? n1 equal to n2. n2 means what is n2 value? 30. So, n1 became 30. Then what we did? n2 equal to temp. It means we assigned temp value to n2. What is the temp value? Temp value is 20. So, n2 became 20. So, this is what we are expecting. What we are expecting? n2 equal to 20 which became here and n1 equal to 30 and n1 equal to 30. So, this is how you can swap two numbers using a third variable. If you have any questions, please ask it in the comment section. I will try to explain that. Now, let us see how we can swap two numbers without using the third variable. So, we will not use this third variable. So, let us create another class, new class, swap two numbers without third variable. So, we are swapping two numbers without third variable. So, I will just copy 
these basic things from here. So again we have the same two numbers n1 and n2 will not take this third variable I will remove this and before swapping we are printing these two numbers now what we will do we will write the logic so what we will do is first thing you can write n1 equal to n1 plus n2 then what you can do n2 equal to n1 minus n2 then what you can do is n1 equal to n1 minus n2 now let's print it after swap i just copied here you write after swap let's execute it run as java application so here also you are saying it swapped before it was 20 and 30 and after it 20 and uh, 30 and 20 so what we did we we have two variables n1 equal to 20 and n2 equal to 30 so here what we did we used n1 equal to n1 plus n2 so what it means we assigned n1 plus n2 to n1 so what n1 became n1 equal to n1 plus n2 what is the n1 value n1 value equal to 20 so 20 plus n2 value n2 value is 30 n2 value is 30 so what it became it became 50 so n1 became 50 now what we we are doing here n2 equal to n1 minus n2 so we are assigning n1 minus n2 to n2 so what is n1 value now n1 value is 50 so n2 equal to 50 minus n2 what is the n2 value n2 value is 30 so 50 minus 30 which is 20 so now n1 is 50 n2 is 20 here what we are doing n1 equal to n1 minus n2 so n1 minus n2 value we are assigning to n1 so what is the n1 value now n1 value is 50 so n1 equal to 50 minus so this 50 is this n1 which is nothing but here and n2 this n2 is 20 so 50 minus 20 which became 30 and your numbers are swapped 20 and n2 equal to 20 and n1 equal to 30 this is how you can swap two numbers without using a third variable if you have any questions please ask it in the comment section i'll try to explain thank you